Skyview's offense, man, that is so hard to, you know, simulate at, at practice and, uh, you know, having that opportunity to, you know, once you get the first two, three, four series in, then you, uh, you know, you get a feel and you kind of get settled in and the kids really get a good feel of what, how that offense is really ran because the scout teams have a hard time with it. Um, and we knew that was going to happen. Uh, our special teams, that's on me because we did not, we did not practice them live this week. We just mainly just went through to their fits and everything. And uh, we definitely need to work at that, my gosh. A lot of the biggest things were, were on our kickoff. Skyview kind of got a couple uh, really good returns on us. And I think that's what we got to work on in this upcoming week. Our receiving core is awesome this year. We got Big Disley and John DiAgostino, receiver. And uh, they're awesome. And the coaches do a great job with our, our passing game. We got tons of plays and a lot of different options for for different coverages and, and things like that. I thought he had a pretty good, pretty good balls, and uh, you know, it's uh, you know, some kids, uh, and the kids came down with it. And that one Wyatt David had on this sideline, it was phenomenal. And and Big Disley running the ball, he's a big target, and backs out of the backfield and hitting Wyatt David a couple times. It was an awesome game. We uh, started out kind of hesitant coming out on that first Friday night, and Sky Skyview played great. Um, they definitely uh, they showed them they showed them uh, what what we need what we got to expect this upcoming season. And uh, props to Skyview.